Well, we know that gas prices are up right now, and that is causing a lot of people when they're making a purchase to consider electric and hybrid vehicles. Makes sense, but how much money could it cost you to make the move, and what other factors should you consider? Our Allison Gormley tells us what's the deal. Some car companies are saying they'll be all electric in the next decade or so. And while a lot can happen between now and then, this is what the transition looks like for people who are choosing to go electric a little bit sooner. Mike Raza is a fan of electric cars, buying his first one in 2017. Got tired of having to worry about oil changes, maintenance and everything else. Since then, he swapped out the car for a small electric SUV the Volkswagen ID4. It costs between 40 and 50 grand, but the federal tax credit drops the price $7,500. To charge it overnight, Raza bought an at-home charging station for under $200 on Amazon. But the charger he bought doesn't plug into a regular outlet, so he needed a 220 volt or a dryer plug installed in his garage. While the job can cost around $400, his was double because the breaker box was full. When he hits the road and needs charging. It has access to Electrify America. It's included in the price for three years. Depending on the drive, the car can go up to 250 miles a charge. We've taken this car to Michigan, caught a charger in South Bend. We're there for about 30, 35 minutes. When the three years is over, he'll have to pay per charge. For about uh, $4.25 in a gas car, you're going to get somewhere between 25 to 40 miles. And using the national average for electric cost, you're going to end up getting about 150 to 175 miles for that same $4.25. Trey Hill works at the VW dealer where Raza bought the vehicle and said charging for a road trip just takes a little planning. Whether it's Electrify America's charging network or one of the other charging networks, there's 22 or 23,000 charging stations, so you can find one just about every 30, 40, 50 miles or so. While the battery should last longer than a decade, a replacement is expensive, but the technology is evolving too. Instead of replacing the entire battery for 10 to 15 grand, VW made it so you can replace sections instead for a fraction of the price. Helping to create a driving experience Raza found so nice, he's buying the car twice. Now this is just an example of one electric vehicle on the market. If your favorite car maker doesn't have one out already, it's likely just around the corner. Keep in mind with the delays going on right now, you might not be able to actually get your hands on it for six months to a year.